with Self Care for Men, I am pleased to be joined by Ethan Plant, the creator and founder of Peanut. Make sure you check out our video on the lower leg. And we are now going to do a short routine, a self fashion release routine for the upper leg. Yeah, okay. So, you know, our glutes are very important uh, as a driving force. And the nature of today's, you know, life, we sit too much. And so they're not as active as, as they could be, uh, which can promote a lot of overuse of our low back. So I like to kind of start off sitting, you know, one steer on each of uh, your butt bones here, and you just kind of slosh around, move around a little bit, okay? You can start to walk yourself towards the high glute. Now, I'm not saying your, your butt is big, but the butt is big, okay? There's a huge surface area, so we're gonna have to manipulate our body to, to get certain areas. And uh, like we had said in the last thing, we really kind of want to look for the uncomfortable spots and work those, okay? So as I'm doing that, I can start to sit out on one cheek, let me go from the side right here, okay? So we kind of start to sit out, you know, you want to just, it's self malfashioned so I can't feel what you feel, so you got to have that, you know, intuitive part to it, but look for the spots that are tender, okay? Um, I like to tell people, get a little weird, mm -hmm. you know? Um, and as you keep sitting out, you're going to get into that booty's knees, that side boot here, okay? Very important for walking, running, um, and when you jump, you're keeping the knees from caving in and preventing ACL stuff, so I've got one sphere in that side boot, and I'm just kind of pulling. Now, in that uh, the, the pre stuff, before you work out, before you play a sport to do this, you don't want to get too deep. So what I like to do is just kind of activate and just move around. So I, I, love, I love this with movement. Yes, well, absolutely. And if you kind of put your heel down and hinge like this, it's very similar to that feeling of a minivan walking where you're, you're getting fatigued there. So you're really waking up. Now afterwards or on off day, you could just literally just melt and just hang out there for a while mm -hmm. um, and get that compression. So that's the, that's similar to let's say for sh for stretching before a sporting activity you want to do a dynamic stretch where you're you're right. it's like movement and you're not holding the stretch and then after would be the static stretch where you're holding it for much longer so it's the well same part. sort of well uh, part. Yep. Layer. Yep. You, just, you really don't want to go too deep too long with the weights you will create these natural uh, you know chemicals in your body that are going to make it kind of sleepy and right. that's all. so. As you keep going, you get that front hip bone. Everyone feel that right there. Okay, if you put the groove of that peanut right in there and then just kind of lay out straight, you're going to get into that, that hip flexor, okay? Um, look from this side here. Not very comfortable, uh, but very good for, you know, getting some better rotation. Uh, just kind of freeing stuff up because I believe that most of us are short tight in the front, right? Mm -hmm. tight in the back. From all the sitting area. Correct. You can kind of donkey kick here, you dig the toe, um, but that's a great spot to hit as well. Okay. All right, now when we talk about the quad, we talked about foam rolling, yeah, it's a cylinder, so it's got more surface area. Mm -hmm. um, you can you can really get, it's a cylinder on a cylinder, a quad's a cylinder, so you can get, a, it's, you know, a little bit easier, but like we would also say this is more painful. Yes. So if you got the patience, uh, you can really work down the quad, and, and you can you can just have to, to roll a little bit, I personally like to start right, right above the knee. You don't want to be on the knee, but right above the knee. Okay, that's where the quadriceps, if the quad being four, they'll come down with the one tendon. Mm -hmm. So I want to try to just, at that junction, just kind of free it up a little bit, get it unsticky, and then start to roll. But again, you got to manipulate your body. You got to turn, you know, you got to, you got to get in different spots. So now we're going to talk about the IT band. The IT band is, is, a, it's a very tense thing. I mean, you probably could, and I've done a good down level. You can probably hold a car with that, thing, right? It's, it's super strong. Problem is, it gets glued to the vastus lateralis, which is that side part of the, the quadriceps. So what I like to do is get right on there and just kind of saw, go back and forth, try to get the glide back between the two uh, pieces of tissue. Okay, and you can work your way down towards the knee. Uh, if I was using a foam roller, I would have somebody go from the hip to the knee. Mm -hmm. Real slow, take a whole minute, just barely moving, and it's almost like two to two face, just you know, so you can get that uh, that flow back. Did you do any movement with this, or did you just not? You can, absolutely, you can. I mean, I like to, you know, but that's if I just bend the knee, I can feel a difference, you know. Exactly. Um, and I like to do that saw action too. Um, but uh, yeah, it's it's something that uh, a lot of people don't really like that area. It's, yeah. yeah. Uh, just nuts. No, just just hang it, hang in there. It gets easier. The more you do it. Easier it gets. Um, 
And now we'll talk about the hamstrings. Sure. Can I borrow that chin? Sure. All right. So a very easy way. Yeah, I'll do it that way. Very easy way to get the hamstring uh, is, is is using something where you have an overhand. So my legs are going to bend, right? So I'll just sit in here, and now I'm going to lift up. I'm going to put that. You can do two spheres. You can put in the groove. You can use one sphere. Mess around, but you just kind of get in that high hamstring, and it takes a little time. You'll feel it eventually, but you just kind of try to get your legs straight, swim in, and over time, over a couple minutes, you're going to keep working your way down. All the way down to the bottom. And you again, you really want to look for the spots that are a little tender and, and, and you just work through it. Okay? But if you do one side, don't do the other. Try to jump. You're going to feel a difference in that, in that one side. You're going to say, hey, you know what? You're going to do this side now. You know? So, I mean, <laughs> the legs, these, from the glute to the quad and the hamstring, these are such powerful, powerful muscles that get, there's so much in there, they, they get glued. So if we want to have better performance, a better gait, if, if we have a, a, a nagging knee pain or you know hip issue, the more you can work through that tissue, the better the marrying puppet that we are. The better the things are sliding and gliding. Sliding and gliding. Just yeah. like the skin, mm -hmm. you know? It, it, it should all glide. And if it doesn't, that's where we get our adhesions and knots, and uh, which then creates bad movement patterns, which then is going to create you know the nagging pain or injury. Again, how can people reach you? Reach your website? So my website is p-knot.com, p-knot.com. Um, if you, you know, want to purchase one of these at the checkout, there's a coupon code area, and I want you to use the, the Cardinal, okay? Ed Cardinal's last name, Cardinal. All in lowercase letters, and you get a 10% discount. And, uh, you know, he's going to have all these videos with different tools, different people, people like me. You can just start to explore, and, and it's self care. It is really self care. That's awesome. Uh, the longer you know, you can you can keep yourself limber. You're gonna feel what you want to be active, and the longer you're active, the longer you're gonna live. Awesome. Awesome. Well, thanks again. Yeah, thank appreciate you. it. Looking right. forward to uh, the next uh, body session. Perfect.